Hi, it's Martha of Just Martha Designs, and today I am coming to you with just a little update and a planning video. I know it's been a while since I've had any videos coming out, and that's because I've been sick since February. I'm really struggling with my asthma. I had respiratory infection in February, um, about the same time that we were going through an epidemic of the flu through our school. And since that time, it's been um, really difficult to try to overcome um, everything that I was going through. So um, just recently, I ended up in the emergency room due to some respiratory distress and really having chest pains when I was just from standing, walking a few feet, just because I could not catch my breath. My asthma has gotten really out of control. I'm still waiting on my um, pulmonologist appointment so that I can see a pulmonologist and see about getting everything back under control. So it's really difficult right now. Um, <clears throat> I do apologize for my voice because it's I'm still having some little bit of issues and I'm hoping I'm not wheezing. Um, but I have my water and I'll be drinking some water as I go through this, but I'm going to do a planning video. Um, have not, um, and honestly, I've been kind of working through my, been working through my planning as far as what's working, what's not working and still kind of, um, I keep my weekly journal that I've been writing in as far as my progress about things. And so just to share a little bit about my progress for this week and some of the things that I've been journaling about um, for this week, it's been more along the lines of trying to get my weight under control. I realized when I went to the doctor um, and had not had a scale at home, so everything kind of like crept up there and I wasn't really aware of it. I was aware of it because I could tell by my clothes, but um, trying to get back into that. So part of what you will see when I pull up my uh, planner is that you will notice that I'm like being more meticulous about leaving room for meal planning just because um, I've gotten into a really bad habit of getting out of that meal prep and I need to get back into that just just to keep up with things but um, when I went to the hospital they put me on some steroids so I've had a little bit of energy actually I've had a lot of energy um, really the best I felt in days so I finally managed to get my house back under control because I was to the point that I really didn't want to cook in my kitchen because I was tired and I just could not get things accomplished and my kitchen was a wreck and I'm like I need to get in here and scrub and clean and um, it's one of those things when things around you are kind of out of control and in chaos it's a little hard to get into the habit of doing things just because you seem overwhelmed when you walk in everything's out of control so um we're gonna be <clears throat> we're gonna be planning out meals um and i've even started my grocery list because i know that saturday i'll be shopping and um i have a long list of things to do so that that should Cover, that should cover a lot of things. Um, also, um, I'm going to be using some of my March kit to um, for my planning. I have come to the realization I've done a lot of, like, I have tried to fill up every place and have, like, no white space. I didn't like that. Um... I also did very minimal and I it was okay except for the fact that I felt bad and I really didn't work my planner um, you have to work the planner if it's gonna work you have to work it so goal planning this week I'll work on the weight that's my goal planning um, make meal prep a big huge deal um, I actually worked a little bit yesterday cutting up veggies because I was I realized I was throwing out a lot of veggies because I'd buy them and not prep them 
and I realized that if I buy them and prep them as soon as I as soon as I purchase them that I'm more likely to um, use them eat them so that's been a huge thing and then also um, another thing that I really want to work on is to work my business so um, I'm gonna flip the camera and pull everything up and we'll get started Okay, so this is my weekly, and I'll probably pull them out individually. You know, so I can. I've already started my grocery list, and I just kind of like took no big paper and cut this in half and did a little punch so that I could just slip this in here and keep it in there for the week. Um, but I'm going to start with pulling these out. It's a great thing I love about the Happy Planner. And this is the Big Happy Planner, and um, I actually created my stickers for both the regular classic Happy Planner and the Big Happy Planner. I'll set that aside, and I'm going to start with this one first. And I'm not going to cover up the dates I told you guys. Let me make sure that I'm, like, focused in. Um, so I'm not covering up my dates just because... I could, but I don't want to. I would much rather keep things as simple as possible. And I will, you know, work on a little bit of things. But the first thing I'm going to do is I am going to cover my little bottom down here because I do want a little bit of color. Um, but I'm not, like I said, I'm not going to cover my date covers. And I do hope that you can see this. Okay, so let's see if we can't do this again. Um, so I'm going to put some little washi down here at the bottom just because I like to do a little bit of decorating, not a whole lot. I'm not a big, big decorator. Like I said, I found that. Um, I'm okay with a little bit of white space, and that just did not do perfect, but. Anyways, all right, so have that down, and now I'm going to, like, come over here and do a little bit of to-doing, and I'm going to use, like, this came out of my budget stickers, just little flags, and I'm going to use these flags to kind of cover up where it says notes because I'm not going to use the notes. This is going to be my little to-do section. And... I had some small to-do stickers, but they're in my planner that is in my classroom. When I left Thursday, I did not know I was not going back to work on Friday. So, all right, so this is my to-do section and I'm going to add in some little checklists for my to-do section. I was speaking to, we had parent-teacher conferences Thursday night and we have parent-teacher conferences tomorrow night, which is Monday. And so I was talking to one of my students who is a very smart student, but they allow themselves to fall behind as far as um, keeping up with deadlines. And so I'm planning to take her some stickers. Um, just because I thought that it would help her she had like a little checklist and teaching her how to use her planner and you know her mother 
and are both teachers. So we were telling her that we have to stay on top of things just because we know how important it is. So I really want my little to-do list. And so as I come across things that I need to add to that, I will. <clears throat> and also down here at the bottom, I'm going to add a little thing for exercise because that is going to be a very big deal for me to track. And I'm wanting to finish a book this week, so I'm gonna use my little reading sticker at the bottom. And I'm out of all the books that I'm currently reading right now. So this is exercise, just to track when I exercise. And then I'm going to finish Wonder. And hopefully I'll be able to start on something else. So on my to-do list for this week, I know that I have a doctor's appointment coming up, so I have paperwork that I have to do because it's a new doctor's appointment. So, that is the first thing on my list for this week. And at this point right now, I'm going to leave it as that's all that I have to do. Down here at the bottom, I'm going to have my meal prep. <clears throat> Move around a few things. Glossy stickers here. All right, so I'm going to leave myself a lot of room here. Okay, I'll add this down here. So these are my meals for the day. You know what I did there? that one to the other side. That might be all I have, except for this one. All right, so. I need another sticker here. And I want it to match. Okay. All right, so house cleaning. And I'm just going to add a little check box here. things that I need to clean. Throughout the week. <clears throat> and that is my kitchen. Living room. Bathroom. 
bathroom. Bedroom. My office. Um, the hallway. And of course, laundry it needs to be done. So that's that. Um, I don't think I have anything. Monday is parent teacher conference. And that is 3.30 to 7. Tuesday and Wednesday. I don't think I have anything going on that those days. And I think I'm going to leave that as that for right now. I need paperwork. I need to have my grocery list completed by the time Saturday rolls around. Okay, leave that for right now. And let's pull the other one in. And the first thing that I'm going to do is to put the little washi strip down here at the bottom. Just a little pop of color. So, now that I have that on there, um, whoops, I need some more stickers for my, to mark my meals for that day. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Here we just have one of those days where your fingers do not want to work. That is me right now. Alright, so let's put my meal plans. Ooh, sounds like somebody hit something out there. I do live like right here at a very busy intersection, which is why you can hear traffic all the time. And I do meet all the time. And sometimes you can hear people's phone conversations. And I don't think that they're quite aware that we can hear their phone conversations. Because people talk about a lot of very personal and private things. When they think that they are in the safety of their car. If they only knew. Okay. Yay. All right, so. Meals. And I'll have to like figure out what I have going on. All right. And I have I need another big old flag. Ooh. About to lose my paper up here. And I'm going to go ahead and put a little flag up here because I have a doctor's appointment. Um, 
on Friday. And I'm going to put a weekend sticker up there. Haven't really done anything for the weekends lately. That's all right. Most of the time I work on my business on the weekends. And I do a lot more house cleaning on the weekends. Whoops. Weekend and I'm going to be grocery shopping. Oops. Also, payday. Loud vehicles. All right, so we'll be grocery shopping. bills to pay but I'm gonna add that into my into my budget planner all right so now for my checklist for things that I need to accomplish for business into my checklist because so I mostly work my businesses on the weekends because Monday through Friday I am teaching all right come on now all right, so this is for <clears throat> business. I will. So I know that I need blog post. And I need to update my blog. Realized that it was like really not what I wanted. Um, let's see. I do need to schedule some Instagram. Plus my Facebook I want to do at least a video and I'm working on some Easter cards That's currently in the works and I do have um, my April kit is coming along so I need to finish it and have it put on Etsy I'm also working on 
a birthday kit. And I'm also working on There's something else I was working on. Was it an Easter kit? It was an Easter kit. Even though April will have a little bit of Easter, um, I'm give a little small Easter kit. I was thinking that's what I was doing. Plus, um, I'm going to redo some budget stickers and. working on some better icons. I'll leave those two blank because I may add something here later. All right, so looking at meal plans. Um, for Monday, uh, for my lunch, Probably going to be, I know it's not going to be a sandwich, that's for sure. Um, trying to cut down on carbs, trying to cut down on carbs. I'll probably just take the salad, which will be fine. And then for dinner, probably I have fish up there. We may do fish. I would say fish tacos, but um, let's see. Fish and yeah, maybe we could do fish tacos. Fish tacos and chicken tacos. think the boys would not complain about that. Lunch is going to be a taco, whatever I decided to take or make. Um, dinner for Tuesday. Oh, wait a minute. I won't be here for dinner. Scratch that. I won't be here for dinner. I forgot all about the fact that I will be at work through dinner. Boys are on their own, so that means my lunch on Tuesday is not going to be a taco. It's going to be salad again. And for dinner, we will do fish and chicken tacos. Salad, and that should be the last of my salad. <clears throat> and then lunch taco dinner on Wednesday I think I'm going to bake some chicken 
Make the boys some mac and cheese. Some broccoli. And that may be it. So lunch would be chicken and broccoli. Dinner on Thursday. <clears throat> uh, fish. <clears throat> Excuse me. Potatoes. And some Brussels sprouts. For lunch on Friday, I will have fish and Brussels sprouts. And for dinner on Friday, hmm, Let's see, maybe. No, I don't want to do that. I don't think I want um, Hmm, let's see. I could do that. Maybe. Trying to debate. Do I want soup on Friday? Swedish meatballs. I do have that. Hmm. Don't want to do that. Guess we'll do baked chicken again. Mm, baked chicken. The boys get mac and cheese. Broccoli. And green beans. I'll make one child happy. Um then on Saturday, I'm going to have a salad for lunch. That's going to make me have to force myself to chop up veggies. And dinner will probably be... I may do subs for dinner. Lunch on Sunday, we'll do a pork loin, salad, and dinner on Sunday. Will probably be the pork loin. Salad and whatever else I decide to add to that. Because it'll just be two of us. Alright, so that's the way it looks. I still have some empty spaces. 
I like having empty spaces because then I can make notes of things that are going on. Um, and that way it's like great. I do have, like I said, I have my grocery list. I've started to make things out and then um, have that going and keep it in there so I can just pull it out on Saturday when I go to the grocery store. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the week and I hope you enjoyed this planning video and hopefully there will be a lot more as soon as um, you know I can create them and I do hope to have some card videos because I am working on those Easter cards and Easter is coming up very very quickly so anyways um, have a great week have a blessed week and I will see you later